Howdy folks and good morning from UMW Toyota HQ here in Shah Alam. It's a beautiful day to check out the new Toyota Camry. Okay, 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 okay. It's not completely new. I think some of you who are looking at this might be like, huh, Chris, you're on drugs. Ah. Why? It doesn't look new at all. It looks like the same like the previous one. Well, the more eagle-eyed among you would notice this beautiful brushed aluminum insert, grey aluminum insert. Didn't have that on the previous car. But I think the most important upgrade for this model is what's under the hood. So yeah, it might be a little bit of a facelift, but under the skin is where all the magic has happened. Yes, this we finally got the dynamic force engine from Toyota. Why is it a big deal? It's a big deal because I can't find the catch. You know, just now during the rehearsal, I could have, I could have found it immediately, but now I can't find it. Damn it, where is it? Oh, here it is. Okay. So, hey, bonnet struts makes me feel like a Jedi. Okay, Dynamic Force 2.5 litre engine, 209 PS and 253 Newton meters of torques. Yes, that's the big deal that's happening here and a revised gearbox which I'll get into later and if I don't, I'll put it in the description, yeah? So, there you go. One, one more look before I close it. I don't know, but are you the same as me? Do you like this hissing sound? when the struts are working. I do. So here's the dynamic force engine. Finally, we got one. Yes, looks pretty packed. 2.5 liters, more than 200 bhp. Sorry, it echoed because I'm in the lobby of the UMW Toyota HQ. Okay, before I show you the front, let me show you the back. This car now has rear passenger controls. And of course, being a Camry, Oh, I can sit very, very comfortably back here. So, something tells me that this car is meant to be chauffeur-driven because it's got the... Uh, you can actually... Sorry, can you see that? By pressing this, you can actually uh, incline the rear seats. It's very, very cool. And if I can open this, I will show you... Oh, sorry. I didn't open it. But, uh, yeah, you can, recline, you can recline the rear seats, but... Let's see. Does it work? Oh yeah, it works. Cool. Can you hear that working behind me? Very nice. Now, how do I open this? Do I just pull or do I push? <laughs> Weird. I'm gonna have to ask them how this this is supposed to be opened. But uh, maybe it's not. Okay. So this is not supposed to be opened. And uh, I think they just added this pad here. So the controls are actually just here and I think they just added this pad I don't know why because it doesn't look very nice but anyway I'm getting ahead of myself here let's go check out the front and another way you can tell that this car is meant to be chauffeur driven ooh, LED lights, is this so the rear passenger here can actually push this seat forward I'll bring it back yep so if you're sitting at the back and there's nobody sitting in front of you, you can actually do this. Or if there is somebody sitting in front of you and you don't give a shit, you can also do it. I've done it many times to fellow media. Yeah. I think this pad was added in after after assembly. It looks like a it looks like the uh, afterthought. See? This is not very Toyota Camry kind of stitching, but uh, anyway. If you're wondering how much this car costs, they haven't got the price yet, but expect it to be just below 200,000. Yeah. So, let's go. Let's go see the other bits. Here we go. Okay, my favorite seat in the house. Yeah, that's me. Hey, folks. My favorite seat in the house. The driver's seat. Yes, of course, it's electronic. And uh, oh, they left me the key. <gasps> they left me the key. Can I have a look at the key. So, that's the key. All right. And they also gave me the brochure. A very long brochure. Um, I can't start up the car because we're indoors and I don't want to give everybody carbon monoxide poisoning but I will show you what happens when you put your foot on the brake um, and push to start the engine. Okay so I can't start the engine because we are indoors. I'm so sorry but uh, even though I've got the keys I don't think I shall do that but there you go huge screen huge screen here and uh, I would say that's what 10 inch a 10 inch TFT. So it, it supports uh, Android and Apple CarPlay. You know what? I'm, I'm too, I'm too, uh, I'm tempted. I'm tempted. Let me just uh, 
press the start stop button without pressing the brake and let's see what happens okay nothing well oh something's happening camry camry toyota okay all right good yes i understand so there you go and i'm gonna press the brake but uh there we go i did i'm not starting the engine so everything's sort of come on unless it's you know so quiet that i've actually started the engine and didn't know and didn't realize not ready to drive there we go but the ignition is on so i just wanted you to see what the uh, instrumentation looks like and now you can because i've done that and the air conditioning three zone air conditioning has actually come on which is kind of cool yeah nice so piano black finish over here uh that's not a button i think this could have been a button to release the gear bo uh, the gearbox <laughs> release the glove box but it's just a regular soft release yeah some cars have the uh, glove box release button over here but this stands this is just a dummy didn't start or stop anything uh no sd card but yeah you do get a digital uh dash cam so shall we go through this extraordinarily long brochure a new camry ex exquisite dominance unleashed oh there you go that's a very very long brochure let me go to the part where you can see the engine so this is showing the interior i don't know if you can see that sorry a lot of reflection but let me just go to this uh dynamic force engine okay so i think when you start up there's more let's press that and see ah yes so there you go a lot more controls at the back once you started up the car but you can so thanks to me you can adjust the seats you know you can adjust the seats when the car is off <laughs> so that's what i said about the android and apple carplay okay seven inch color information display mid so i was not too far off yeah i'm used to things that are eight inches <coughs> so that's why i said eight inches anyway moving along so still on the interior interior i think i missed the dynamic force engine yeah i think i missed the uh talk about the dy dynamic force engine anyway so i'm gonna put the uh specs here we go 2.5 liter dynamic force engine with vvti -E. it's got pedal shifters as well yeah, right there very cool and if you want to play with the engine, but it's Camry, so I don't think you want to play with the engine too much. I don't know if you can see that. Sorry, the screen's gone off. Okay, so that's it. I'm um, really sorry I missed the uh, media preview the other day. Yeah, I wasn't feeling well in the morning, and although I tested negative on a RTK test, I was feeling really, really bad, and I decided to skip it. So that's why I'm here all by myself today to check out the new Camry. I'll put the important bits in the description and also a web link where you can go and download or read all this. There's a lot to be read, but today it's just a preview for you to see what the car looks like in the metal. So let's turn that off and bye-bye. Trip summary, 0km. Yes, shortest test drive ever. But <laughs> like I said, this was just for you to have a look at the camera. Oh, bless you. Somebody sneezing very loud there. That's very, very cool. There's a, there's the, uh, what do you call it? Wireless charging pad right here, which is really nice. Yeah. So I'll put the important bits in the description. You can read about it there. Um, just to let you know, there is a Eco Normal and Sport, uh, hill hold and electronic parking brake as well. You can also play with the gears over there by toggling, or you can use the paddle shifts like over there, plus, minus, left and right. Cool. Okay, so I hope you've enjoyed this uh, very, very quick preview of the 2022 Camry. Yeah, it's shaping up to be exactly like what uh, a Camry is supposed to be. Um, taking this with me, so I'm just going to leave it up there so that I don't forget. Yeah, we got USB ports here. We got a charging station. Yeah, kind of cool. Okay, because we're indoors... Um, Everything reverberates, you know, everything uh, hidden cubby hole right here. And wireless charging on top, which you can turn on right there. Nice.
nice 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 okay so um very very quick preview sorry about that uh no test drive uh unless you know you think i'm gonna crash through that <clears throat> no don't think so i want to be invited back for the next event i do not want to be banned oops i hate it when that happens sorry about that camera but yeah hey check this out flow mounted pedals not bad not bad sorry flow mounted accelerator pedal and still an up mounted brake pedal but that's it that's the camry and she's looking mighty fine you know the camry has been around for 30 years yeah it's hard to believe it's been that long but yeah the first camry was launched in malaysia 30 years ago 30 years plus i think if i'm not mistaken because i came back yeah it was like the early 90s very early 90s the first generation camry was here so yeah 30 years plus very cool these cars are all registered because they were part of the media short drive uh, preview the other day which i missed um, remember folks if you're not feeling well uh, even if you though you've done a rtk test and it's negative don't forget there's an incubation incubation period yeah so test again after five days even though you had a negative test and i wasn't feeling well so i decided to skip it just being responsible numbers have gone more than twenty thousand for the last few days which is crazy but uh, that's beside the point. No, actually, that is the point. That's the reason why I was not here. And that's the reason why I'm here all by myself today. All by myself. Don't wanna be all by myself anymore. Okay, sorry. It's been a while since I've gone to karaoke. But uh, that's it. That's it from me. And that's it from UMW Toyota. Thank you for joining me for this very quick walk around. I hope you enjoyed it. Remember, not really that much new rims. Yes, a little bit of silver now. Uh, on the outside, not much as far in so far as a facelift is concerned. Uh, however, if you notice, it's got that now, which is like a C, which is like my name. Kind of cool. That's it, but the biggest change is definitely there under the bonnet. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. Uh, maybe I'll get this car out another day for a, a longer test drive. In the meantime, take care, stay safe, be cool, and uh, stay out of crowded areas, yeah, and maintain SOP. Take care, y'all. Thanks for watching. Bye.